Memos play a very important role in an analysis project with Atlas TI. These are the spaces in which we reflect, in which we make an effort to integrate, in which we make sense of what we are finding. You can write as many kinds of memos as you want, but uh, I would say that it makes a lot of sense to have memos that are of a methodological type, such as, as, uh, such as a research diary, uh, memos that have to do with the exploration of the content, such as a memo for, for your key codes or a me memos by a topic that you want to explore or research objectives and so on. So, But the main point is that instead of writing outside of, of, of Atlas TI, you are going to write inside of the project and that will allow you to connect your writing to uh, the other pieces of the project. You can connect a, a memo to quotations as well as to code. So let me let me let me show you how to proceed to create memos. You go to the top left corner plus sign new memo. And I'm going to call this memo the research uh, research, research diary. On, on, and I will write I will write here and what will I write? I will say uh, today I created a set of codes for each one of my research objectives. I proceeded to code and as I did that I, I found the need of create new codes. Bottom up, bottom up coding. Okay, so I all am I doing here is describing or commenting, discussing, elaborating upon the process of analysis, which is extremely useful, I would say. So this is an example of a memo. Now, the memo now shows on the margin. Okay, and that's it. So there you have it, research diary. Now, you may want to connect the memo to specific uh, segments of the text. So let's say that here you have uh, you have a a, uh, a segment that illustrates or supports uh, what you are writing in the memo. So all you would do is you would you would uh, drag and drop that memo into uh, one of the quotations. There you go. And the code, I'm sorry, the memo now shows connected to this particular quotation. And that's very something very nice that you can do.